Hey everyone, this is Vikas from OVFX and in this tutorial, I will show you how to create cinematic gunshot effect using Fusion. So let's have a look. Alright, so this is our final output. So without any further ado, let's get started. So first of all, we have to take a new composition. So go to file menu and take a new composition and close the previous composition by clicking on cross button here. So now we have to import our footage. So click on the folder and this is our footage. So drag and drop to the flow window and click on window layout 1 and drag this file to the viewer after that click on fit button here now we have to check our composition size so go to file menu again and click on preferences and here is frame format in my case my composition size is 1920 into 1080 so it's good for me now what we have to do my footage duration is 582 frame long and my composition duration is 1000 so put the value 582 and hit enter after that we have to import our muzzle flash file so i have already given a link in the description so click on the link and download the muzzle flash after downloading go to the folder and import your muzzle flash file to the flow window now we have to merge muzzle flash node to the footage node so take a merge node by clicking on the merge button here so this is our merge node connect this green point to muzzle flash node and yellow point to this footage node after that select that frame where gun actually fire a bullet you can forward or backward frame by frame by clicking bracket button on the keyboard so this frame 191 is good for me after that drag this merge node to the viewer and go to timeline window and increase the size of this little bit and here is our muzzle flash loaded to file so drag this one by holding left mouse button okay after that come to the flow window and take a transform node so select this muzzle flash and click on accept which is a sort button of transform node okay now select this merge node and go to apply mode and choose a screen now increase the size of this window and set this muzzle flash according to your footage
so we have done this now we have to add a color corrector node for final color correction so select this final node merge 5 and go to tool menu color and take a color corrector node so here is a color corrector node and drag this to the viewer after that come to the properties window of color corrector node and decrease the value of master saturation uh, like uh, 0.8 or something so it's good decrease this value of uh, master rgb lift also now click on label tab blue channel and set it uh, like this Next, we have to add a lens flare. So go to folder and import lens flare file to the flow window and merge this with our footage. So take a merge node, connect this green point to flare and yellow point to color corrector node and drag this into viewer. After that, select this merge node 6 and come to the properties window and choose apply mode to a screen. And then select this flare node and take a transform and 